Okay, another uh, video here on the Discovery build. Um, looked at Boyd's solution uh, on his Trekworks channel, and I decided that is the simplest thing to do. Originally, I was thinking maybe I could just make an access point, uh, leave this top panel removable like that, and then I can slip the battery in and out that way. But Boyd's solution, far easier, is just take the bottom section here, glue all the side pieces to it, and then with the top section, just continue these slots all the way down because they, they stop about right there, and just cut those all the way through on both sides. And then the top portion can just slide onto there, and then you can slide it off. So that's what I'm going to do. Very simple solution. Uh, now rather than uh, putting the piece of wood uh, inside, as he shows down in here, I'm fabricating a piece that the tubing can go through to support the metal tubing that I'll put in there like that. So I'm going to cut this last piece that'll be the brace on the front side of it. Then I'll put the two pieces together and then mark where the hole should be and then drill out the hole. So that I think will be an in-house fix so I don't have to go to the hobby store or go to Lowe's or Home Depot or anything. I can just solve it all with the styrene tubing that I have and the sheet styrene that I have. And everything should be fine. Okay. So now this piece I'll just glue across the bottom down there. And that should provide me with a more than strong enough support wall for the tubing, the metal tubing that will pass through. There we go. So a really simple solution there to take care of that. So I'll let that dry. And notice that I uh, that I did notch it, gave it the dog ears, so that it will fit uh, snugly within there too. So between being form fitted and having the middle reinforced with some of the extra uh, sheet styrene that I had left over from cutting this piece and then adding the square tubing to it to act as uh, mounting supports. Uh, that should hold this uh, piece in place extremely well once I glue it down in there. Okay, so that's that's the whole idea right there to secure um, uh, the tubing that will go through. Now I'm going to have to dog ear, yep, so I'm going to dog ear this
Is it too tall? Too tall, okay. I thought I'd cut that to the right height. So I'm gonna have to, once this dries, I'll take, uh, I'll shave the top uh, portion of that off. And uh, then I'll have what I need for that inner brace. Okay, come back to you later.